Okay, everybody. Uh, I've loaded in a couple of other mods here. I put in, um, I've loaded up uh, Cure Virus. Oh, look at that, 41X. That looks like it could be working for the animation one, but I'm not in the mood for playing the animation. It's really annoyed me. Besides, I wanted to play with all my other mods. Um, now, the other mod I put in, I activated was the Force Backpack. And I think that was it. The only two extra ones I've added was the Cure Virus, which I'm not sure how to do that just yet. Uh, but anyway, let's load up my last save. Now, anybody who watched my previous video, I got shot by Bob. In my arm. I'm trying to figure out. I'm going to have to uh, find a clinic somewhere where I can find the needed resources for me to get that bullet. And so up my arm, maybe, antiseptic, antibiotics, that sort of thing, so that I can, uh, now, see outside, I wonder? door just opens so that could mean another NPC bots in here. Yeah, someone just broke through. I don't know if I want to go in through here. Ah! So <laughs> Samantha, okay, hey Samantha. Look, I'm not gonna hurt you. Samantha, where'd you go? Samantha. Samantha! Come here. I want to recruit you. Medical check, Samantha. Why'd you take off? She's trying out all the different doors. And they do go around taking loot and all that stuff. And she's obviously a friendly kind of a friendly. She's not a very nice person, but take it off like that. I'm not a fan of that. She's trying out all these doors, I think. I need a key. Uh, turn some lights on here. There's no way that there'd be any... Now, uh, there might be... Alright, be careful there. Looks like she could have taken care of that zombie. Mayonnaise, don't need that. Samantha! Come back here, young lady. I just want to talk to you. Where'd she go? Stop moving around, Samantha. Yeah, what do you want? Okay. Uh, invite the group. Offer food, give your melee weapon. Oh, crap. Didn't want to do that. Okay, Samantha. Uh, Got to call her over first, obviously. Uh, off of food. Thanks. It's medical checker.
This looks okay. Uh, ah. Call over. Auto selecting take. Corpse, drop corpse area. Oh, cool. You can do all kinds of stuff. Okay. Uh, give order. Offer water. Sure, how else to do this? Give order. Uh, patrol. I don't know what she's just doing going back and forth. Let's see what else can we do. Give order of follow. Do up the options here for keyboard keybinds. Now it was the keypad plus that was causing the issue there. Lower follower distance. Okay, minus and the add button. Now that should hopefully work. Stay closer. Come on. I'm looking for something I can use for uh, Okay, Samantha, I want you to Doctor, survival, give treatment to anyone. Got it. I think. I don't know. All right, let's continue on going here. Don't want to go through there. supplies. did the trapping and all that. Did I do carpentry for... Oh crap, yeah, I gotta do dirty bandage. Remove that. Still bleeding. <laughs> Alright, we got a zombie out there. Oh, man. 
Now she didn't help me at all. Alright, let's call her over. Alright, Samantha, I need you to... Um, I need you to... find a weapon. Okay, obviously she's only going to build it. Samantha. Okay, let's go find those stairs down. There we go. See, Samantha got her. Oh, good, you're back. Whoa. Oh, good, you Okay, I gotta find you a weapon, Samantha. Alright, Samantha, I need you to loot room, weapon, go, find yourself a weapon. She's off to find herself a weapon. And I need medical supplies. Yeah, there's obviously somebody out there. Let's remove the broken glass here. I'm not going to find anything here. As far as medical supplies. Let me bring up my map. There we go. Alright, let's... Uh, up this way. Give me a clinic. Whatever that place is, I have no idea. Little shop. Little cake shop.
quite surprised it lasted this long, considering I got dirty bandages and everything else. Luckily, I have a few sheets that I ripped up, but I'm, I'm, man, I'm telling you, this isn't going to go well for me if I don't get healed up somehow. I can find a doctor. Could that be a clinic? Chester. Good. Awkwardness of it is not too high. Condition is kind of low. Alright, for now we're not going to be messing with that. What I'm looking for is medicine. Now it looks like to be still part of the Now this doesn't look like it's anything to do with medical. It's more, uh, let's continue up. What's that right there? Oh. Wow, they're really stretched out. Yeah. Taxi key. started. Oh, I didn't want to get out. No, no. All right. How do I start this thing? Uh, right click, key and ignition. Uh, Engine's dead. This is dead. Oh, well, hoopy do. And I'm on empty, so it really doesn't matter. Uh, All right, let's, uh, Hoping for. Come on, I just need to. Uh, it doesn't look like to be a doctor's. Uh, let's see if this is a clinic up here. Let's go. That does not look like a clinic to me. actually think there'd be a clinic around. I 
had another arrow show right there, which could mean either another NPC. Maybe, I, I'm not sure, but okay, we're in more of a... That's Bob. Now, I don't know if that's one of the Bobs. It could be after Bob right now. That could be a... Well, I don't know if that's a clinic or not. vehicles aren't going to be uh, all that much. I may have to make my way down this way to find something. Find a home that'll have, like, you know, medicine cabinet, that sort of thing, something I can work with. No idea what these places are. What I was kind of hoping for was was a hospital. in it. Who knows? No. Absolutely nothing. Better check myself here. Damage, moderate damage now, was minor damage. Gotta get that bullet pulled. And I'd better, I have to keep, I have to re remember to, uh, I think I get to. I'm gonna have to see if I can't clean those. <laughs> I just noticed two others. Are, uh, two others. <laughs> okay, we are at a garage. <laughs> with you. Oh, that vehicle looks like it broke. the windshield looks like it's kind of broken. What sort of shop is that? Pizza. Now I'm not interested in pizza. Froggy burger shop, it looks like. Spiffo's. Oh, it's Spiffo. I have no idea where my uh, NPC took off to. I should have stayed close by, but. I 
earrings, dirty, okay, no. Okay, let's go find a sink. I need to wash up my bandages. Oh, hold on. Okay, we might have something here. Come on now. clean or do I need a bar of soap? I'll probably, oh, we have something there. Yeah, someone's coming in. Could be Bob. Hi there, Brandon. Let's see what you look like, buddy. Oh, he took off. Oh, well. He's probably taking everything that I can find in here. Don't be stealing everything now, Brandon. Brandon, it's good to, uh, to see that you can kill. Oh, come on, there has to be soap or something around here I can use. Antidepressants, it's good to have. Hey. Nothing. Then again, it is just a hotel, so. Oh, crowbar. Yeah, definitely. Fine in there, Brandon. God, nothing around. There's nothing. Bloody rubber duck tweezers. Yes, maybe. Okay, let's see if that'll help me. I don't know if that'll work or not. 
There we go, tweezers. Remove the bullet. Remove the bullet. Bandages, rip sheets. I don't have any antiseptic. Is there any anti antiseptic here? What do we have for dirty rags? Clean rags. Clean them all. Okay, finally, I got the bullet out. Finally. I gotta keep an eye on that bandage. Hold on, what do we have here? Oh, it's just a, okay, I thought it was a, like a key thingy. Boy, these cars looked all banged up and everything. All right, I just need to find myself some antidepressants. Not antidepressants, but, um, there's Bob. <laughs> I can't climb that fence. All right, what do we have here? Yeah, everybody's named Bob on the map, but his name is Brandon, obviously, you can see. And he's non-violent to me anyway. Bloody heard and shot me in the first place. Oh, well, I'm hungry, am I? Alright. Let's just eat the chips. Alright, let's go. have in here. That's all boarded up anyway. Which would make this place a great place to be. Uh, if I can get in there. Bob's in there. How did Bob get in there? How'd you get in there, Bob? That's all boarded up. Damn. Okay, how about this? Crowbar. How do you go to primary to secondary? I can't remember how to do that. There we go. Carpentry, miscellaneous. Add selecting, disassemble, door. I need a hammer, stone hammer. I do have a hammer, I think, on me. I think that's how you do it, I'm not sure. Ugh, I just need a screwdriver, which I do not have. Alright, well... Be true with an axe, I wonder. Oh, 
I wonder if I can break it down. Ah, that's the field. There we go. Hi there. Great place to, to be doing this, though. Starts humming quietly. All right. Uh, Julie, actually, I'm not interested. Yeah, and you can pick up all those pieces if you want. Doorknobs, hinges, planks. So you can rebuild a whole new... Oh, my God. You were trying to go in there to look for antiseptic and shit. The whole point of even going in these places. Nails, glue, oh jeez. A sledgehammer. Wow. Added pants. Yeah, okay, I'll, uh, I'll wear those. That wasn't very nice of you guys. Still bleeding. I'm gonna have to find sutures. Needle sutures, that sort of thing. Bloody heck, man. I'm gonna bleed out before I'm even. I finally was able to find something I could pull, get tweezers to pull it out. Woo, 22. What do I have for a weapon? I already have 22 rounds. Ah, it takes 45 ACPs. Okay, well, that's no good to me. Nice to see that it's there, but... Do you want to sleep? Yes, I do. Okay, now, just to let you know as well... Oh, crap. Zombies become much more dangerous at night. I should never have gone to sleep yet. That's not good. Yeah, zombies become much more dangerous at night. Now you're seeing a lot of the, like the error codes. This could end up being an issue for me. Hey, Julie. Yeah, can we get to, uh... There's the, uh... See how dangerous they are. Okay, my map says there's a building down this way here. Bail bonds. Um, yeah, those are error codes there. Why am I heavy load? Move speed reduced. What do I need here? What do I have here? Holy crap, yeah, I am. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to move that, we're going to equip the bat, we're going to put the crowbar back in the bag. Uh, 
Doesn't see anybody around me right now, so I'm pretty good to go here. Um, 29 rip sheets. Don't need that many. any shotgun shells. I only I only found one. <sighs> you guys got a washroom? Yes, you do. Or actually, it's not a washroom, but it could hold something for me. Now, if I do have to end up restarting a whole new game, I'm going to start without a backpack and all of that stuff. Ah! Yeah? PvP fight. PvP fight. There we go. How much damage did I take on that highly critical damage? Oh, man. Uh, remove bandage. Ah, as soon as I come in, you hit me super hard. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Yeah, I'm near death now. Is he going to... He actually had a backpack. He didn't have anything there, though. I wonder if he's gonna turn. I wonder if that's possible. You know what? I should watch. Since I'm already gonna die. That I do know. Let's see if he comes back as a zombie. Let's just sit here for a second, guys. Come on, you gonna turn into a zombie for me or not? Are you? Come on. Turn to a zombie. Come on. But then again, see, I'm going off the premise of The Walking Dead where anybody who dies who's not infected sort of thing is going to wake up as a zombie, but apparently that's not going to be the case. Well, you shouldn't have attacked me. I wouldn't. Seriously, guys. I cut it out. Boy, 177 death. I wonder if I can close my wound with duct tape. Let's, uh... Let's see if I can do that, guys. Remove bandage. Maybe I can close my wound. No, I can only do that. Okay. Because if there was glue, like super glue, I can close my wound that way. Without having to use stitches, but... Yeah, they did that back in Vietnam as well. Um... What can I craft? Craft sheet rope. What else can I do anything here? I can't do diddly. Now I do have other mods that will allow me to expand on what can be created. But I just uh boy. If I can stop that bleeding. I'm telling you, I'll be able to uh I'm telling you, it, that would be one of the best games I have played. Like, is that a fence near there? I can't tell. Uh, that is a fence. Yeah, no, I mean, <laughs> this would be the best game I've played in a very long time. I usually end up dying within the first day or so. And I'm still, I'm actually in going into the second day here. Surviving for one day.
Ooh. All right, we got a piece of bandages, we got a first aid kit. We got sleeping peel, peels. We have soap. We have bottle of disinfectant. All right, remove bandage. Use disinfectant. Uh, adhesive bandages. What else do we have here? First aid kit. Drop the duct tape. Duct tape. Clean the rag up. What is actually in the first aid kit? Okay. My health is getting better. Remove critical damage though. Infected, the bleeding has stopped. Disinfect, stitch up. Uh, let's disinfect alcohol wipes. Uh, let's stitch it up. Whew. Let's put uh, a piece of bandage. Hopefully I can get back to normal. Holy crap, guys. Woof. That is amazing. Now, let me fill my water bottle. Holy castoli. Uh, hold on. Let's take some painkillers. Um, did I not have painkillers? Antidepressants. Um, you know what? I'm gonna have me some. I'm only gonna eat half of my peanut butter. I like peanut butter. I like my peanut butter. A little water. Let me check out. Yeah, I'm getting better. I'm getting better. Still critical damage. Skill points. Now you know what? You may think this is be this is gonna be the craziest thing you've ever heard, but I don't know how to add skill points available. Like how do you add that? I don't know how. Because I've never lived long enough to do it. Is there something I need to do? Like skill points, six experience points. I don't know how to do that. Like I said, simply because of the fact that I have never lived long enough in order to do it. So if you folks can leave a comment to tell me how to do it, I'd really deeply appreciate that. Alright, antidepressants. I already have antidepressants, but we'll take them. pills. Now, I should have waited until maybe I was like really depressed and stuff like that, but I'm kind of hoping it will increase my mood in a sense because being injured and almost dying and have somebody attack you and you know, you think that you would end up being a little kind of put out by people who just want to keep snapping. That guy attacking me though. Holy moly. Okay, can I wash myself? Uh, 
Wow. How many water bottles do I have? Okay, that can't be right. Okay. Now, please don't die on me. Alright, maybe I can take sleeping pills. It'll help me. Maybe it'll give me that option at once I do that. Okay, I can't lock the door. Uh, sleeping pills. Let's put the first aid kit in there. Take pills. You kidding me? Come on. There we go. Yes. All right, everybody. This is where this is going to end here. Uh, let's first uh, oh, remove the bandage. Put some more alcohol wipes on it a little bit there. Bandage. Uh, we'll use adhesive bandages for that. Keep it clean. And all right, folks. Um, wow, I was able to find the materials. I almost died. You know, <laughs> crazy. Um, but I'm loving it. Take care, everybody, and have a good one. And thanks for watching.